Hello, I'm Trevor Alonzo. I'm here to talk about what might possibly be the last in-game trailer. Or at least the big trailer before the movie comes out, because I'm sure there's going to be a lot of TV spots. I'm probably not going to talk very much about this because the trailer doesn't show very much, which is a good thing in this case. I don't want to be spoiled by some movies. Well, most movies I don't want to be spoiled. Okay, so most of this trailer was kind of clips of their past sort of their beginnings or like rough times the Avengers went through. For the most part it was in black and white except for the red. The red came out. We all kind of figured that red means death. We see slightly more of Hawkeye and what we assume is him training his daughter how to shoot her bow and arrow. And there's a lot of speculation. Is she the next Hawkeye? Is she the next generation Hawkeye? There's also a huge speculation again and I even think it that he lost his entire family in the snap, which makes him become Rowan. We see more of the world that they're still missing people. I'm kind of wondering if Ant-Man came out of the quantum realm at the beginning of this movie, and it's sometime later, and he's just now finding out the effects of everything. We do not see anything of Thanos. We know Thanos is going to be in it. We know it's going to be basically a Thanos movie, but we don't see any footage of Thanos and so far we haven't seen any new footage of Thanos which is all right but I'm fine at this point because the movie's not giving away too much. Yeah, I hated the trailers for Batman vs Superman near the end like I think the last trailer they made had Doomsday in it and it's like you didn't have to give that away and like they gave too much away for that movie. Yeah I like the movie I know some people don't but I definitely hated when the trailers give too much away or definitely give away you know huge stuff like what might happen i'm looking at you dark phoenix one thing that we really do see that's pretty cool is everyone has the same suit and it it's speculation that it's like the space suit like they're going to the space and they're all wearing like avenger space suits maybe it is a space suit maybe it's just we're all on one last mission so this is going to be our suit it looks cool it just adds to the speculation that they're going into space. Maybe they're going into a quantum realm altogether. You know, so you have to wear a special suit to go in. You can't just wear any Avenger suit. We're not sure what the mission is. We're, we really don't know which comic story they're going to follow. I mean, we kind of know they're going to fight Thanos. So there's a bunch of different stories where they fight Thanos. We know that, but... Are they going to save everyone from the snap? Are they going to reverse it? Is the Infinity Gauntlet even working? Or are they just going to bring Thanos to justice and beat him? And we know Thanos is in it. For the people who are griping again that might think, oh, Thanos isn't going to be in this. It even said at the end of Infinity War, Thanos will return, which usually goes to the heroes. You know, it usually says the Avengers will return in. I'm also surprised at the end of the trailer it doesn't say tickets are on sale. Because we're coming close to that date. Maybe they're waiting until, you know, the last week of March. Or maybe they're waiting until right when April begins. I like that they showed Captain Marvel in this. Even though it's there for maybe, like, five seconds, four seconds. It's pretty cool. Overall, I like this trailer. I like the way they're advertising it. I'm glad they're not giving too much away. You know, sorry for those of you who don't like the way they're doing it and not showing any real action. Looks like they show snippets of action. Looks like they're sticking to their guns that they're only showing 15 minutes of the movie. I'm glad they're sticking to their guns and only showing 15 minutes of the movie before the movie comes out. Rather, it's 15 minutes of the movie randomly throughout the movie altogether. Or it's the first 15 minutes... I'm not exactly sure, in which it's hard for some movies because some studios are like, okay, we need to show that huge thing or we need to show this or that at the end or we want to make sure audiences are there so you have to cut this into there. Okay, show that huge bad guy thing that's going to happen or whatever because then fans will walk go no matter what because of that so i'm glad disney is letting them do their thing i'm glad they're like okay let's do this and that again i think people at disney are better advertising them with marvel than they are with other movies all right so i like the trailer tell me what you thought of it or what you're thinking of the avengers in the comment section and thank you for watching my video